Achtung. Ah! <lacht> oh. Ich ja, schaue sehr gut. Ah. Wish! Oh, oh no, he's dead. I think, maybe. Oh, you don't have to play anything? Because it's yeah, a guitar, industry, man. I guess it glitched. Oh, it. Those hit. Another moon lantern. All oh, right. Um, Thank fuck. Okay. Ah, so this is how this place looks. This is a uh, crawl's room, apparently. <laughs> there is a dead person though that I kind of want to see if I can talk to. Oh, lads. Hmm. Protruding books. That might be worth a look. I'm in a conversation. Oh. Oh. Of course, there's nothing to say. That's fine. Oh, alright. Mm, okay. Are we... Wait, you have quick set, right? Just just seconds ago? Yeah. Wait, are these are traps we pulling here? one of these books? I think there's a traps on the floor, just FYI. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But... I mean, are we... Are we... So, a uh, chest over here. One second, let me just... Let's have some privacy up in this bitch. Bye-bye! On the... There's uh, also a lever over here. There's lots of things that we can try and interact with. Um, I'm going to unlock the heavy chest first of all. That's what I'm going to do. I'll take the heart. You just picked up a heart? Yep. I guess you need this one. Son of a bitch. Yeah, you think now I, I my character won't be as bad? Yeah, people who have hearts just sitting in their pockets are usually much better people. I, I agree. Yeah, I passed the uh, the roll. I'm, I'm a champion. Okay, can I pull on one of those books? Hold on, I'm opening chests. Oh. Seeing what's in there. Anyone do any poison damage? I could, theoretically, yes. When I, I use poison. Orb. So when you poison a weapon, no one's just using it at, uh, like passively, I guess. Mm. No. All right, then I will keep this because nice. I finally have a cloak. Oh, nice. Let's see how it looks. Oh, that well, it suits you. Yeah, that is a Ken cloak. It just needs some dye. Do you want some black and white dye for them? Um, I want black the dye. Hmm? Ooh, lavender might be Lavender good. dye for Ken. If you have lavender, I will take lavender. Um. Uh, but yeah, basically, if I do poison damage to a, a foe, I'll also heal 1d4 of damage, and I do have some poisons, so... And if you double attack, that's like 2d4, basically. That's pretty good. Uh, I don't know if technically poisons both weapons, so I probably want to stick to my offhand, I guess, but... There you go, oh, Ken. it might not. Yeah. I don't know, actually. But I can attack multiple times with my off hand. Yeah. You've sent it to me? Uh, it's, it's on the floor. Oh. Why do you not just put it in my inventory? I forgot I could do that, to be honest. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Someone was pulling a book, right? Uh, yes, I would try. That's okay. Maybe yeah, I mean, you're probably, gonna, tra you you're probably gonna trigger the trap, so... <laughs> Oh, it became blue, but you know, blue still looks better, I think. Oh! Oh! Oh, okay. I really hope this has not uh, pissed off everyone in the tower. Uh, it doesn't seem to have. Hmm. That fortitude. Alright. You don't mind if I attack first? I just want to test out my new ring combo. If you're going to attack that guy, that's fine. I want to attack this guy first, just because. Yep. I can stealth attack and I. Oh, wait, no. 
I will use a base attack. That's got kills. That. Yep. Did it. Yep. <laughs> that is pretty good. I don't have advantage. Damn it. Uh... Should I come and stand next to him? <laughs> Wait, they're undead, right? So they're immune to bleeding. Yeah. Um. Possibly, yeah. Bing bong. At me. Wow. That's a ninety four percent chance to hit. Oh, nice. It's uh, like uh, purple on the inside of the cape. Or lavender on the inside. Oh, yeah. You're right. Really? I was going to say, if you didn't do the one point of damage, just take that guy out. <laughs> I got you, homies. All right, I'm just pulling the like next uh, row of books then. No attempt to work out what combination to do it in. Just like there was almost certainly like in the many many books that say Balthazar's notes, there's almost certainly a clue. But Samurai's just now. Nah, I'm gonna do it. Well, my int isn't high, so what is happening? I don't like the sound of that. Poison. Gas. Go, go, go. The door's locked. Oh, God. Gas filling the room, huh? Destroy the door. Destroy it. I've opened it. Have you? Because it's still locked. Alright. Oh god, the poison's coming in here! Run, Ogre Lady! <laughs> Save yourselves! Oh wait, it's gone. Oof. Right, lads? So anyway, should we read the notes and try and work out how to interact with that? Or sure. do you think it's all broken now because Sam has interacted with every single one of them? I have not interacted with every single one of them. There's, one oh, there's one. a sensor here, what does that do? Um. Alright then. I'll read the notes over here. There's a bunch of them. There's one over here as well. I would read them in order because that's, I think, three over there. Yeah, I got three. Two. One. Where's one? A three, two. And. Has anyone picked up one? No. There's attention acolytes, but I'm not seeing a one anywhere. Um, I'll just take a look at these two then. No, then install a drain beneath library's conventional medicine shelf. It's wasteful to let all the blood seep through the flagstones and it will rust the spikes besides. A line slashes through the above, the same hand in fresh ink below. Disregard the smell gives you sweet dreams. That was two, and now three. Request from the next caravan, any works by Mordenkainen must catch up on current events. No Volo. Better a century of ignorance. Hidden Vellum, whatever that language is. Holds ink like no other. Could ha harvest from an acolyte? Question mark. New copy of Swift and Sudden Death for Library. Current volume, badly scorched. That's it. Uh, Alex, do you want to interact with that class book in front of you? And then I'll interact with the Gifyanki disc. You're on mute, by the way. Oh, whoops. Uh, yeah, I can read it out. Cool. Uh, this is a log on the work of one of Balthasar's necromancers, Cressa Bone Daughter, dated two ten days ago. Don't know what that means. Two ten days uh, ago is like an old-fashioned way of saying twenty days ago, like oh, like right. four score, seven. It's like one hundred and seven. Uh, after the state the fallen one was in, I never expected Cressa wouldn't be able to save it, or would be able to save it. Sorry. I was hoping the usurped thing would die that 
<clears throat> that's what it would have wanted. Um, it's not as if Cress are studying it is going to prove much. It was damaged in the attack far beyond what the mere tadpole could do. But she seems fond of the foul creature. Let her plate with it. Another entry seems to be written into this log dated a ten day later. I should not have, in hindsight, let Cressa keep her pet. Ever since it was shipped onto one of the Nautiloids to be deployed, she has been inconsolable. It won't survive out there, it needs me, it isn't like the others. The feral thing will make a fine warrior for the Absolute, and now my best assistant is distracted thinking about it. Pa, she will come to heal again soon enough. Alright, I'll interact with this Gift Yankee disc. Cutscene. From slate and engraved with Githyanki writing. The symbols are striking to look at, but you aren't sure what they mean. The disc from Crash Yellick was distinctly similar to this one. If you can match the symbols, you might find a legible pattern. Uh, okay, I will roll an investigation to seek a pattern. Yes. Oh my god, Ooh. these rolls are so oh. tough here, man. What the fuck? Good thing we set up on inspiration. No, I'm not going to spend it. If it's a straight yeah, nat no. 20, and yeah. I can do other options still, plus other people could try and roll it if they wanted to. Yeah. Probably can try and do it if they want to. I very nearly just clicked it because it was the first button, though. Try. You can't make any <laughs> sense of the symbols. You should take the disc to Lazelle. Oh! She might know more about it. So I won't have impressed her with me understanding it, but at least I have more opportunities to talk to Bay. so... That is actually true, yeah. Uh, yeah, sure, let's compare the disc to the one from the Kriish. A pattern forms as you gaze at the disc, and from within that pattern, a story emerges. It is another chapter in the tale of the Githyanki prince called Orpheus, the prince of the comet, part three. The histories tell us <coughs> that Commander Voss, Gestil Kithrak, pierced Prince Orpheus clean through with his sword of silver. That his flesh was torn and fed to the great red dragon, Ephelaman. Mm. Like its faithful roar out this tale. But beneath the roars, we hear whispers carrying truth and prophecy. The prince of the comet is not dead. The prince of the comet will come again. The prince of the comet will liberate us from Blackith's tyranny. Praise be to Mother Gith, queen of the one sky. Praise be to your son, Orpheus, the true heir, Prince of the Comet. It's an intriguing tale, and a forbidden one, given how expertly it was encoded. Lazel will surely want to know of this. This is the first time we've gotten, like, a message from the game like telling us, Yo, this character wants to hear about this. This is the first time we've heard this. Guys... I think I might be the Comet Prince. You reckon? <laughs> and why would you think that? I don't know, I just got a feeling. I put it away in my pocket. <clears throat> um. And then there's one more book. Uh, Tommy, Alex and I both interacted with one of you wanted to read this book. Yeah, sure. And then I think that's all the books in here. Also, there's this... the rest of a severed body if you want it. Wait, which book attention acolytes? Yeah. Yeah. Let's gonna have a look in this other room for the other notes. Okay. A reminder. Acolytes have permitted entry to my chambers for the sole purpose of collecting moon lanterns. My library is not to be tampered with. While the Absolute appreciates your eagerness to learn, my bookshelves do not. Any requests to borrow from them must be given to me in advance, and are like to be refused. Should you desire information on poisons, do not think to read any tome on the subject here. They are inclined to grant more knowledge than the written word could provide. Remember, the Absolute's purpose is better served by a beating heart than a poisoned mind. Though, if you choose death, I will ensure you serve her still. Alright then. Does anyone mind if I interact with this telescope? Uh, I already I think did. It just says oh, okay. I spy it with my little eye. Did yeah. anyone read Goblins the Mapple Gambit? I did Gambit? Alright. 
Goblin After troops. Goblin troops, though crude and a bit dim, are valuable because they are adaptable and can be fitted into a number of different military roles, excelling as archery skir skirmishers and walk cavalry scouts. Jesus fucking Christ. If vigorously drilled, some can function as disciplined phalanxes armed with half pikes, and even the ones who can't be trained to march in a step can serve as a prime catapult fodder. I just want to point out, I fucked up saying archery skirmishers and warg cavalry scouts, but I didn't fuck up disciplined phalanxes. <laughs> Impressive. The key to recruiting a tribe of goblins is their profound respect for their priest, who lead the tribe members in the worship of all conquering Maglibiet. Therefore, let the high priest of the seven tribes of the southwest sword coast be invited to a grand council, a feast where they will be well fed, well flattered, and well lubricated with jugs of plonk lace with a mild paralytic. The priest will awaken with new guests in their crania and be led into a docile devotion to a new and greater god than Maglibiet, the absolute. And trust me, where the priests go, the warriors will follow. Advisor Balthasar. Alright, what are you doing, Sammy? I will pull on this last book. Wish me luck, guys. Did you want a quick save before, cronk. or...? Nah, if you die, you die. Alright. Bing bong! Aha! Click! Ooh, ancient altar, eh? Insert item. Guys, scan your inventory. Do you have anything? I mean, I've got the GIF Yankee disc. Oh, I got the heart. <clears throat> the heart was just a heart. Though. Oh, okay. Wow. Nice inspiration. Now, maybe you could have just put in any item in there. <laughs> I mean, maybe, or maybe it was the right item. I'm going to unlock this chest. Oh, well, there's a bunch of moon lanterns. There's a dead pixie. Yoink! <laughs> but they were already imbued with Netherese magic. Where did that magic come from? Bro, I unlock a chest, Tommy immediately fucking opens it before I can even Yeah, I just want to see what's in it. You can interact with it as well, can't you? No, it said already in use. Oh, I haven't taken anything. That's fine, it's just like, just the image of the rogue being like, ah, I've, yeah, I've got it, and then just, oh, what's inside? Can I interact <laughs> with the ritual circle? Uh, hey, it's a hat. Uh, I'm sending a hat to Samo because it's a wizard hat. Anyone want an elixir of necrotic resistance? I'll send it to Tommy. What's that? I've sent you an elixir of necrotic resistance since you're kind of a oh, tank okay. boy. Thank you. Did anyone read the research read. notes? I'll read them. Though I'd say Alex is our tank boy, seeing as I've got a disadvantage with saving throws, and Alex has 91 HP. Yeah, but also Alex is, is, second a, life. is resistant to everything already, isn't he? Literally everything but... I have redirected some materials from beneath the tower. I plan to simply raise what forces I need inside the mausoleum itself, but the general prefers that no more of his family could be disturbed. Even so, I may have no choice. The temple will not surrender the Night Song easily, and the general's invulnerability depends on it. Aha! Hey guys, should I get in this Balthazar's torture cha chair? I tried already. Oh, yeah. Think. What about the ritual I'm sure circle? He will... I'm sure he will forgive Just a dialogue. little transgression if it yeah. frees the army to move on Baldur's Gate last. Who did the ritual circle? Alright. This Night Song sounds like the source of Ketherick's immortality. Maybe I can use it again. That what was literally the, the quest that like the chat chose for us during the twenty four hour stream was to find the night song. I thought I thought Isabel was the night song. Mm -hmm. Alright, so um where exactly is is it where we're going? Uh where the quest marker is on our mini map. <laughs> uh North very basically. close teleport. Ah, there. There's also apparently a hidden treasure that we can try and look for, which looks like it's outside of the tower. Ooh, yeah. Do we want to quickly see about that? Actually, I'm not sure if it is outside or inside, but... It seems like it, may, it might be on, like, a tower or something. Well, it looks like it's saying down, so it's either inside and down or outside and down. I'm going to go walk outside and you guys can walk inside. How about that? Where am I? Uh, about? I'm not... Convinced that I can get around to it on the outside, so I think it must be only on the inside. I think we can get there from here. Let's move. Yeah, I think it's down these stairs, probably. 
And we haven't been here yet. I'm oh, coming. To click on the stairs. Oh, you have to click on the stairs. What the fuck? <laughs> I'm a coming. I'm, I'm still on my way. Tell everybody I'm on my way. I'll come back. Guys. Just, so, uh, mm -hmm. Pete knows where to go. Ken is on his way. Mm-hmm. Thanks, man. I got you, man. Boop, there is boop, blood boop, leading boop, to that door. Boop, 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 boop. Alex, what boop, did you do again? Boop, boop, boop. I did nothing. Oh, yeah, well, why? we both know. What the fuck is this place? Alright. This is an entire something. Your ass is an entire something? What is? Your mother. Also, this isn't where. Yeah. This isn't where uh, the hidden stash is, but do we want to explore this? I'm thinking we might get into trouble, but also cool stuff. I am. We're down here. I'm fine. There's with blood you. on this door. Yeah. There's also heavy oak doors we can interact with there, but they're guarded, so. This wasn't illegal to go in, so. Yep. Oh, a torture bed. Ah. Alex, this is your room. <laughs> Chilling to behold. Why wouldn't it let me lie down in any torture beds? Boring! Oh, scalpel. Anyone want to talk to the questioners? Uh, yeah, I, I don't mind. Go for it. Yeah, let, let Alex do his dark it, shit. Yeah, I was going to say, it seems like his sort of alley. Yeah. A new face. Do as the warden says, when she says, and you'll be fine. Oh, when when we started the fight in the non-canon intro to this uh, stream, uh, they the lady tried to take me to prison, and I went, "No, fuck you." I bet you end up here. And maybe. Oh yeah, it might be actually. As in, it's a prison <laughs> in, yeah. in the tower, so it's almost certainly this one. Ooh, a severed leg. I can add that to my collection. Did you not <laughs> loot all of the severed bits from the severed body in uh, Arthazar's chambers? That also seems kind of you cheating. I think he wants like different bits and pieces. Yeah, I want to collect people. things from different places. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. I'm yeah, gonna this... rebuild Karlak. This prison looks cool. Doobie. I mean, yeah, those heavy oak doors are guarded, but they're not illegal to interact with. That is true. But let's go down here first, since that's where the yeah. boys begun. You wanna quick <clears throat> save? I think it's been. What the time. fuck is that? Yeah, to the left. Is that where the lift comes up, do you reckon, from the Underdark? Maybe. Maybe. Oh, that might... Are you, you... Oh, wait, it yeah, it might actually it directly... straight here, didn't it? Yeah. It's very red, though. Yeah. I mean, it looks more intimidating than I would say Ooh. it should, but... Maybe in a conversation. Oh, get up. Oh, no. the Rescue the tieflings. Are these the tieflings from Animal oh, Grove? Okay. Yeah, I think so. Oh, yeah, yeah I recognize the name. Yeah. You're back in dark, oh, huh? They don't want me talking to them. These prisoners are for disciple Balthazar's attention only. All right, You've let's not pull this one happen again. But you will not be so lucky next time. Sounds like we this need to might... kill Balthazar. <laughs> yeah, this might be a thing. Either we get Balthazar's okay, or we kill these people. Yeah, we should come back here after we do the quest. Yeah, yeah although, I want to say, Balthazar. there is a lot of verticality to this place. I've just like climbed up yeah. a bunch of scaffolding, which is pretty cool. Uh, I mean, oh, oh, there's also the warden. Am I in a legal place? No, I'm not. Okay. Interacting with stuff here is illegal. But being yeah. here is not. Okay, that's Th fine. This seems like a place that is more complete once we've done the ball throw. So. Yeah, no, no, for sure. Oh, so let's do never mind. This area was off limits. Guard can be convinced oh. Otherwise. oh, dear. Oh, they've drawn a staff. Oh, you're seeing what I'm seeing? Yep. Hot wow. Diggity dog. Like, we would have to put all our money together and we, I think we would barely make it. Oh, yeah, no, we're not doing that. I just was nah, like, I mean, no, it's absolutely the not. first time I've seen that that much money. <laughs> yeah, that is like uh, crazy money. I'm going to try and talk my way out of it because I want to leave. I'm not trying to actually go in. Yeah. Ooh, the deception check, though. God damn. Uh, of Ogma. Yeah, I mean, that's my best roll by far. And it's very devious, isn't it? Yeah. You mean this isn't the shrine of Ogma? I knew that the, do the, the, the map was dodgy. The dodgy was map. 
the dodgy was map. Indeed. How is that the lowest DC we've had here? <laughs> Fucking yikes, bro. Wanna use an inspiration so we don't get into combat? We could just quick load. When did we last save? We've also got we have four, four inspiration. inspiration. We have four All inspiration. Right. We might as well just play it normally. Yeah. Not to be saves coming. Okay, let's quick load. <laughs> no, I think that's enough. No. Oh, no. Oh, God. Or we use another inspiration. Or we fight our way out. Combat. The best just isn't good enough. can try and still convince her that you belong here, and then we just go in, I guess. Fuck it, what a deception again. But, actually, no, this map is actually perfectly accurate, because I was sent to join the patrol. There have been reports of someone trying to sneak in. He looks like a tiefling with a tattoo on his face and a blue eye. Fucking <laughs> Christ. This will be the one he passes. Yes, it is. Yeah. <laughs> Just literally the DC. That is crazy. You managed to talk your way in. No easy feat. Oh, the narrator sounds impressed with me. <laughs> Thank you. I'm impressed with that, to be honest. Like. But also, uh, let, let's leave. Let's go. Hopefully, I don't have to talk yeah, yeah, my yeah, way yeah. back in when we come back. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> let's let's leave. Let's leave. Let's also maybe we can always come back. Let's just go to Balthazar. I want to fight. I want to. I want to. Yeah, yes, so we don't want to do the double oak doors either because this is like all the prison, right? So we just yeah, want to go yeah, straight yeah. to Balfour. Like, do, do we still want to try and find that hidden treasure? Because that hidden treasure is not in the prison, then, is it? So yeah, it's let's do that once we're back, I think. Yeah, okay, I want so to Balthazar actual content. Let's just book it to Balthazar. I'm sorry, yeah. is, is talking to people not actual content, Tommy? No. <laughs> I don't like let's people. Let's teleport like to, to Boulder's Gate, maybe? That's a bit closer. Teleport to Boulder's Gate, did you just say? That's what it you said. Road to Baldur's Gate. Oh. Yeah, yeah let's go guys, to Baldur's Gate. Let's go. Just ditch this tower, fuck it. Let's just go to Baldur's Gate. I can Samuel see and I am both thirsty. Uh, Road to Baldur's Gate, you say? To John Baldur, yes. Road to John Baldur? Mm-hmm. Love that man. Why did I not teleport? I hate this game. Ah. Oh, hey. See? There's that Brewer's Arcanical stash that we can't find. Yep. Everyone failed I mean, to check. We can try again. It's been a while. Yeah. It's, I mean, it's physically there. in the world and... Oh, hold on. I can speak with dead with this yeah, person, apparently. Yeah, you can talk apparently. to that person. Isn't this one of the people we killed? It yes. is. All right, well... Maybe you can ask some of the stuff that Black is up to. Then why are you saying that I can interact with you? What ah, is but not to its killer. You killed him. Well, no, I didn't. I didn't kill any of them. I Barely. killed that one. Yeah. Oh, maybe it's like... The, the, when that happens, it's the party, but I've just never seen it happen yeah. where it says I can talk to them when we can't. Yeah. <laughs> we've spoke to many people we've killed. No, we haven't. Have we not? I thought no, we had. Literally never been able to talk to someone that we've killed. Oh. Um, this is a dirt mount, dude. What's here? It's the fucking thing for the poison quest. Yeah, it just it's it didn't. Just here. It just. I didn't even get the roll though. It, no, just, it was just here this it just, time. It just broke, okay, but let that's me good. Grab achievement it. unlocked. Okay. Got an achievement. Uh, okay, I'll so just you, grab it. Yeah, you grab everything and then read the re record of shipment. Uh, I'll read it. Yep, that's the first thing I'm gonna do. What are you doing up there, man? Read. Vibing. T. Sending you the requested ingredients as per your letter. Including the purple, including the purple hey. blood plants, <laughs> I'm eager to see the results of your experiments. Please send me some samples when it's completed. I have a few clients who would, who would very interested. I have a few clients who would very interested in the toxic fruits of your labors. Is that grammatically correct? Yeah, that is. I have a few clients who would very interested. Yep, absolutely, one hundred percent. Alright. Anyway, I'm too far for that. <laughs> I just love seeing Alex it's just like a yeah. fuck's sake smile. <laughs> um so what was that That was to create the poison. Thistle bolt. I can I can craft it. Cool. Um And I got I got inspired. 
Um, or just a note, by the way, just in case it comes up later, if we can try and avoid doing a long rest for as long as possible, because I've got the Elixir of Viciousness going, because I thought we might get into a fight immediately when we enter the tower, so last stream I popped up. So just, if we can try and go as long as possible without taking a long rest when we're going into this mausoleum and what have you. Then... So we reloaded and you kept it? No, uh, what happened is I had taken the uh, one of Viciousness, and then I also wanted to pair it with another one. And then I found out that you can't pair them together. It's one or it's like if you take another one, it replaces the original. So we reloaded, so I just had the viciousness one going. Uh uh. Um Which is the one that lowers my crit my crit range even more. So with my uh with my offhand right now I'm doing crits on an eighteen, nineteen, or a twenty. Fair. So Are we saving this potion in case it's relevant for a quest still, or are we using it? Because what this is it, usable. What does it do? You can code your weapon, they have to succeed a DC 17 saving throw. If they fail, they get poisoned and take 1 to 6 poison damage at the end of each of its turns. Let's keep it for potentially either Balthazar or Keterek, if we end up sure. fighting Keterek. And then if we don't get to use it in dialogue or in like a cutscene or whatever, we'll just put it on one of our weapons and use it in the fight. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Because you're a poisoner here, kind of. Yeah, I've got the poison cape now. Yeah. I'm gonna um, try and remember to use poisons, but uh I have got some poisons if you want them. If you're not gonna use them, then I'll absolutely take them. But... They're better in your hands than mine. Have we been in the morgue? We haven't yet because we wanted to try and do the thing, but that's not where form is, so do we wanna do form first and then maybe do mausoleum? Or not mausoleum, I would say mausoleum. So, yeah. Yeah. Oh the oh there's actually a different mausoleum, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we we're um, going north basically for the uh Buffers our stuff. Yeah, I'm not I think sure we've actually been to Forms uh, Mausoleum. <laughs> it's just that we didn't have a quest at the time. So, shut up. Why are, are you screaming, oh, yeah. Samu? Yeah, I don't know, man. <laughs> I also looted a dead pixie. So yeah. that's probably nice for my. Um... You, you've 100 percent just dangled the dead <laughs> pixie in the cage with the alive <laughs> pixie, right? Just a corpse in the cage. <laughs> yep. <laughs> okay, we haven't done Forms Mausoleum yet because it is unexplored. Hey, well... I brought a little friend for you, Pixie. <laughs> <laughs> Have fun. Bye-bye. Mm -hmm. oh, you want a quick save so we don't have to walk 500 kilometers again? Okay. Oh, hey, we're going to get to hear this voice line one more time when Tommy gets here. Raphael? Oh! <laughs> uh, game Wait, game Raphael, fucking alt tab for me. Look at his health. Look where at is his he? health. 666. Yeah. It's up there. Oh, uh, uh, well, that is Tommy. I've not noticed yeah. that before. All right. That is so cool. That's dope. Oh, that mention? is so cool. There's oh. a sigil up there as well. Conversation time. Our hero thought but a treasure ahead. Did not consider the peace of the dead. Is he like kind From of a narrator? Dark, he went creeping and awoke. No, the narrator's a woman. Sleeping. A new no, like, grave they no, dug, like... which he himself fed. I love him. I mean, I hate him, but He's I love so him. so cool. I yeah. so I love like, I, him. I fucking <laughs> hate him for all the, all the manipulative shit he tried to do with. But he's so Noel. cool. <laughs> but yeah. This is this is a good dialogue choice. I like these. <laughs> Number two is <laughs> standing around and practicing that little recital until it was perfect. I've grown quite fond of you, you know, in my way. I thought it only fair to warn you about the dangers ahead. Eh. He only wants to remind you so that he can try and get you to do the deal. That's the only reason why he, he wants you alive. You know yeah. I'm half tempted to take the deal. I'll work for this guy. I love him. He's great. <laughs> he was trying to corrupt a little girl and it fell a little bit. Someone well, died. I mean, I, I guess that's here in hell. She's capable. What what dangers are those? Oh, we both know they are soon to be revealed. It would be pointless of me to try to buy you from entering, but I can set the scene, as it were, prepare you for your role. Yeah, that's why he asked you what was in there. Fine. Paint me a picture. 
There is a stage <clears throat> down in the dark upon which a great drama has suspended itself in time. Its actors dwell there still, mired in the languor of their long, tired scenes. If you, however, through the dark, go creeping and awake what is sleeping, chances are many more graves than yours alone will soon be fed. Jibba Jabba. Hmm. Paint me a clearer picture than that. Okay. Of course, this guy's got a DC 10 to persuade. An actual devil. I'm a mentor, not your mother. I can <laughs> wax poetic about bogeymen to keep you on the straight and narrow. By all means, stray, explore, hunt. Just don't indulge in the illusion that you're the greater hunter. I'll be pleased to follow up on your little escapades in your camp one of these nights. Oh! Oh. Should you live to tell your tale, that is. Until I'm then... I'm gonna fuck Raphael. Adieu. And just to confirm, Samo, he was talking about tale as in like a story, not as in Ibrius's tale. Oh, right, okay. <laughs> also, a uh, quick question. Who got the Moon Lantern, the second one? I've got it, but if anyone else wants it... Nah. I'll uh, just carry on, two. I'll Before do Before we do that... Oh, there's a mound there. I'm just gonna grab the sigil as well. Okay. Yeah. Out the mound. Uh, yeah, Alex, the there's a sack up there. About. Oh. Alex. I thought you were talking about the sigils that were mentioned by the narrator. Well, by our characters when we approached uh, the door. No, they no, said, like, what are these um, sigils for? Up here. Oh. You might be able to just jump up there real quick. There might be some cool stuff up there. I'm not above grave robbing. There is a book. Would you like me to read it? Go yes. ahead. This field research on the Shadow Curse was quilled by a cleric of the god of the morning sun, Lathander. They were not particularly clever or insightful in their observations, but whatever nuance is lacking in interpretation is made up for in spades with determination. It seems with an eager and hopeful heart, the cleric set out to reach the deepest part of the cursed area to conduct an analysis. Though based on these blood-smeared pages near the book's end, you guess they did not get so far as they'd have liked. Um, I'm absolutely good for going to the mausoleum right right now, by the way, but um, just a flag. We can access like an upstairs area of the House of Healing from here as well. I'm not particularly uh, bothered about it. Not right now, thing. but like I think it might be worth going in after we've done the mausoleum. Yeah. I mean, once we like cooler. use the teleport out, maybe we can like just Step in there real quick. Hey! We ready? Yep. We didn't actually throw it at you. Throw it near you. It's a threat that I'm always watching. And I always have rotten fish. Except for when I don't. <laughs> ah, right. And this place looks fancy. It does There's look pretty fancy. The form mausoleum. Uh oh. Last time there was. I mean, you in a cutscene? Oh. I shall okay. carry out general form's will alone. alone. Oh, it's the head of Balthazar. Who wants to talk to Balthazar's head? No, it's the Herald. Herald. Oh. <laughs> Who wants to talk to the Herald of Balthazar? Sammo? I, I would. I don't mind. Okay. Not wanted. <laughs> All right. That's just the, stat of the story of Korath, isn't it? Not wanted, yeah. not needed. <laughs> Beloved wife and mother. <coughs> Aye, uh, here lies Melodia Thorn. Beloved wife Tell me one more time. Mother. Temple Melodia. Aye, Armiel Tellere. Here lies Melodia Thorn. Thank you. Beloved wife. I failed a religion roll over here. Aye, Armiel Tellere. Manon here. Ooh. Failed. Lock chest though. Um. I'm going to read this uh, temple map real quick. Okay. Um, a hand-drawn map shows a gauntlet of Shah. Its labyrinthian tangle of chambers and passageways stretch across multiple levels, with a vast statue of Shah dominating the central hall. 
Here and there are asides written in a jagged, spidery hand. Balthasar's exploratory notes. Intact wing? Proving grounds? Question mark? <coughs> Ruined wing? Something present there, strange sounds reported. Rats. Why so many damnable rats? Something good here, I hope. Uh, Samo, I've just sent you a bunch of ingredients. I've also sent you a cloak, which gives you uh, healing when you cast spells in melee. Hmm. Okay, so there is a temple underneath this place with something deadly sealed inside. Uh, I'm also going to read this stained book. A small note is squeezed onto the margins of a tome detailing necromatic rites. General form's orders were clear. In order to find what lies beyond this mausoleum, one must walk in his own footsteps, deed by deed, from splendor to tragedy to infamy, as he put it. B. That's nice. He called him, he, you know, Caderic calls uh, Balthazar like his B, you know, like his babe. <laughs> Survival fail? What did I just fail? Do you want to come back in here, Pete? I, I mean, I didn't think I triggered anything over here because I've walked into the room, but I'll give it a go. Just like around this oh. area. Right? Yeah, it failed as well. Tommy, have you walked in here yet? In where? In the room where all three of us are. Oh, that's all right, the inventory. Um, um, screen we've got two failed rolls in here so far, religion and survival. Um, I also saw something we might want to take a look at. Okay. After. And then religion was over here-ish, Tommy. I don't know how it didn't trigger it when you walked in, but... He was there, no? No, that was the survival. Oh. The religion's like as soon as you walk in. Maybe Tommy like triggered it when he like walked past or something, I don't know. Um, You, you liking that cape then, Samo? Um, I'm not sure, because my current one gives me one AC, and for me to get one AC is, like... Yeah, okay, that's Technically fair. impossible. I want to back to sell it. No, no, it's fine. Okay. Um... Because maybe I'll keep it for, like... Because maybe it's better. I'll, I'll still think Yeah, you can, you can have a play on whatever. I reckon this yeah. place is probably poison, because it's all green, but have we walked in here yet? I, I've been there, I've been there. It's it's not poison. Okay. It's just because the, 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 the floor is, like, open. Yeah. Um... I've just picked up stuff from the backpack. There was like a few scrolls in there. Nothing oh, yeah. super crazy. Um, okay, so the room in here, before we enter, um, there are buttons and walls that you can like interact with here, here, and at the end. I yeah. haven't been inside yet, though, because this because there's a grave open. I don't know what the fuck will happen inside. Oh. Crap. Sus. I like how Sam was like, I've not been inside, but here's all the stuff that I've walked, found, and then these two fucking dumbasses just sprint in. <laughs> no caution whatsoever. I want to push the button. I'm going to do something. Um, I've wait, stepped on something. You do. I've stepped on something. Is Isabel Thorne, as in like the Isabel the Cleric? We don't know. Oh. That, that, quite possibly, that yeah. That is actually a good point. In which case, you might have killed a very important character, but also maybe she's not dead if she's like the other forms. Oh. Both by grief, yet daughter. Jesus it Christ, to Tommy. Be. Yeah? You're just stepping on all the fucking traps. No, I'm, I'm finding them. No, you're stepping on them. You just stepped on this one, and then this one. I didn't go on that. Yes, you did. You stepped on both of them. No, I went this way. Nope. Did on my screen. My screen just even had like the click noise around. and everything. Weird. You sure you didn't hear me um, perceiving it? No, it was you stepped on them on my screen and a click went off. Odd. I think we have to like press the correct timeline. Uh, yeah, I found a book about that, didn't I? Um, hold on. I don't think I took it with me. Let me go back and read it. Uh, I've also designed oh, a bunch of the traps, but not all of them. I accidentally got it right uh, then. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I guess we just got it. Yeah. Uh, I want a quick save. This seems... Like... Fight, combat, big boss. Oh, so there's so. like mosquitoes in this room, man. What the fuck? 
I failed the survival roll. And why were you all so fucking dumb? <laughs> Cluttered catacombs. We'll have to. Oh. Yeah. No, oh. It's like cutscene. Low... Cutscene. Yeah. I'm not able no, to join anyone's. Share oh, there we go. private moments or set dialogue. Oh. Curious why this would oh, be a it's going private down. one. Wait, why what? would that be a private one? Yeah. Well, no. All right. But the way you guys were stood was fantastic. Gauntlet of Shar. Oh, religion. Structure. Going by the design. Okay. Well, I mean, uh, we figured that out. We're in a Shar tomb. I mean. <laughs> Can I just? Shaft, I cannot. Of eternal night. Protector of the lost and forgotten. Stone door. Let's fucking bring it on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Yeah, I'm not doing anything yet. Uh, jumping off the edge leads to death, just to confirm. <laughs> right. <laughs> Alright. You figured it out. I was curious. I mean, maybe that's what you got to do, is talk about, like, pain and giving your life to shadows and what have you. No? I'll give my life to shadow heart. <laughs> well, if you want to give your love to shadow heart, you want to walk in and touch that umbral gem? <laughs> Absolutely. Let's fucking bring it on, bro. <laughs> bro, I think if you look into the vault, I jumped. I think, like, I bro, my heart is a big person. I wasn't even paying attention to you, I just... There's, there is a vent right in front of you that you might be stepping on as you approach. Nope. What hour are we in right now? I have to see. 121. I, okay, I have to I have to write that down. <laughs> I, I want to watch that vlog later. I, I want to see that. All Tommy right. just is not learning. Wait, 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 wait. I have an idea, I have an idea, I have an idea. <laughs> Bing bong! That was actually. I have another idea. Maybe I can get through. <laughs> no, no, this, this is an actual. Device. You guys realize you're taking mild amounts of damage from this as well, right? Uh, I'm not. I didn't take any. None of us did. Oh, okay. We're all just like <gasps> slightly injured, I guess. All right, all right, guys. You're all being idiots. Bring it quiet. Move with care. <laughs> <laughs> It's a perceptive. Ow! I was already knocked down. What the fuck? <laughs> All right. Can it's a perceptive her... gem. Oh! 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 Okay. Guys! 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 I need, on, I need whoa, a whoa, strong boy over here. It's now got the so, aura around it. Hold on. Why has it got the aura around it when it didn't before? I think like, it, was, it had like, the aura. It had the aura when we first entered the room, and then we all stepped closer, and it, the aura went down. I think this just means that the shield is up. I think this is just like. I mean, you can try, but I'm pretty sure this is just. Who? Yes. Oh, uh, that too. I'm I'm Wait. blinded. What's happening? Oh. I'm now blind. Yeah. Taking what they hold dear. I walked in here. Oh, I think there was a trap in here. Okay, so it wasn't me who triggered it by trying to jump into it. No, I think it was up. me. Because th that happened at the exact same time. <laughs> That do anything? Yeah, it did. Do we want to end turn? Like, I don't see why we would need it because it's all we are is blind, right? Yeah, no, can do. No real need for turn based mode. Oh, okay. Damage. Uh, quite a bit. Void cloud. Vent the sun. Be wary. This place is trapped. That's not a please disarm, is it? That's just a. There we go. You're fucking lucky, aren't I? Yep. Are there more? Yeah, there's a lot more. Are we taking a short rest? I <laughs> uh, can do. I think that'd be a good idea. I think I'll, I'll that do keeps one my, so my elixir yeah. up, doesn't it? Yeah. Right. Yeah, there are plates in the entrance to these rooms. So. Alright, well, I can disarm them. 
Yeah, done. Perfect. Um, I've also found a lever. I've also found a lever. Shall we use them? I, we at might the same have time? To push all of them. To like what are you thinking there's two on the other side, sort of thing? Doesn't look like I it. I would assume so. Uh, yes, there is. Okay. Fine. Uh, right. Someone come to where I am then, and then I will go and disarm the other two. And so someone come with me to do yeah, the other Yeah, I'll come two. with you. I'll come with you. I'll come with you. Uh, okay, you can't get too close to the circle still. Yeah. Doesn't matter what angle. I just assumed it was like the front, because the shield's like down at the front, but. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I failed a perception roll over there. <clears throat> Okay, wanna do this one first? Do one, do the bunch. Uh, yeah. Oh, I did not step on that. I absolutely did not step on that. That's kind of a little bit baloney. Uh, you can disarm it though, right? Uh, yeah, I've disarmed the plate, but I need to disarm the vent as well. Uh, I can. I'm out of actions because we're in turn-based mode. Uh, either everyone end their turn real quick, and we'll take a bit of damage, or. I can try disarm it this turn. Yeah. If my, you want my... to. My uh, there's there's two vents, but I did it. Hey. Nice. All right. Oh, nice. That that did it anyways. We can exit turn-based mode, I think. No, 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 not for the others. The others are still. Oh, they're still in their ones. In void, yeah. Uh, I'm not in it where I am. I jumped out of it, but I don't know if it was spread. It's basically everywhere. Oh, you need to disarm my vent, Tommy. Uh, there's one. I I can't. Why not? I I can't see the vent, so I'm I can't understand it for you. No, I lit uh, like in game. I can't see the vent, try, so try I can't. Try closer to it. Oh, the void just disappeared. Oh no, it didn't. It's back. Nope. Okay. Uh, I guess end turn but, and then. But we'll there's take no it. void now. Just yeah, you might. Is there something in there that you can put on it, like a vase or something? No, but I'm not in the void anymore. For yeah, whatever he's reason. Standing on the trap. Oh, is that okay? Um, because it's pressurized. So if you put a vase on it or something, it will just not work. Or oh, any like items in your inventory that you don't care about. I uh, I need to um. Wait this till place next time. Is trapped out the wazoo. God dang. I mean, it's a dungeon, isn't it? Yeah, this is like. Trap city. This place is trapped. Oh, thanks. Oh, you Ken. think so? I <laughs> think <laughs> so. How you figure? Very nice. Thanks I mean, that's a very much. Ken move, to be fair. Guys, I think mm. this place is trapped. I'm not sure. All right. Have you also dis disarmed the, the pr pressure uh, pressure plate? Uh, well, on the other side. Might no, as well. Uh, hold on. I'm not yeah, over by you. Uh, that one I've already disarmed. Okay. Bing bong. Oh, I'm gonna have to do the same in my one. I thought I disarmed all the pressure plates. What do you mean the vent? The vent. Uh, you might have to deal with this first one first. The middle one. I would, again, I'd just try... Well, how did we deactivate it last time? Um, was it just time? Might... Yeah, it was probably I, just time, right? I would say, right? yeah, maybe just after like five rounds or something, it just goes away. Yeah. So maybe just stay where you are and we exit turn-based mode. Yeah. You good with that, Alex? Sure. A little bit of gold. Wow. Looting while I'm making sure that Alex is okay. <laughs> it's also a skeleton that can loot. Mm -hmm. And he has a dagger. It looks like it's not going away, doesn't it? Oh, oh there, there it goes. Oh, there we go. Okay, so I need to disarm the other pressure plate and then we're all ready for... You can leaders. also just jump over it. Yeah, yeah, but I prefer just to disarm it, just so we know true. that no one's going to accidentally step on it. Yeah, sure. I got a net one. Well, guys. <laughs> Maybe just stand on it again? It's like, uh, where is it? Uh... I should have used inspiration, but oh well. No, it's okay. I think it's like... There? It's well, somewhere around here. Thing. She's like, I won't blah 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 people who blunder and I'm like just blundering around trying to find the fucking vent. Huh. I have no fucking clue. 
Do you want to just exit turn base mode and just run to me real quick? Fuck it. If everyone's good with that. Mm hmm. You, you do that. <laughs> so you can do it at your own pace. Oh, you're also slowed in there. That's fucking annoying. Yeah, it's difficult terrain. Yeah. Also, apparently, for some reason, this door over here just opened after I disarmed that trap, I think. So. Oh, okay. We can just go through there after we've done these levers, maybe. Well, there's stuff on the other side as well. And stuff forward. Yep, stuff but this forward is like seems a dead to be end, like a magically so... watered door. That's true. Yeah. Um, oh, the reason why I couldn't find that vent, it's already broken. Right. Right, let's try and disarm again. Hopefully I won't get that one. I get a plus 10 to this, by the way, and DC is 10. <laughs> the only way you can miss this. And that time I got a 20, non-natural. Non Fine. Nice. Step carefully. There's a trap. Right, I am at my lever. All right. Uh, countdown, three, two, one, and on goal, we... Real quick, I just like how we're all assuming that we have to pull these at the same time. There is no proof. Nope, but <laughs> it's cool. Or, it, or this the is when, this is when we all spawn enemies in our own room. Yeah, <laughs> or, or the game crashes because it tries to do four cutscenes at the exact same time. <laughs> all right, you I'm gonna, quick save I'm in gonna case quick those, save, yeah. yeah, in case one of those things happen, let's just quick save. I mean, if if it's the enemies, we're sticking with it, right? If the game crashes, yeah, it sounds it's cool. Yeah. If anything, all right. Okay, count us down. So somewhere. three, three, two, one, on go. We click. All right, three, two, one, go. So delayed in game, but it's fine. Uh, the lanterns and oh, now we can't activate the smoke. I guarantee that's what it is. The darkness can't be activated. Oh, that might actually be what it is. <laughs> well, this, this is one of those mystics. Um, uh, looks like we can approach. We can approach. Yeah. Am I? Samo, do you want to do it? Uh, are we doing that? Oh. 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 Who? What? Who did what? Someone stepped on a plate, uh, didn't they? Oh, uh, 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 yeah, so that was I me. I think this is a her thing, because she's talking no, about this, it was me. No, she, she says oh. that each time and it gets activated. Uh, huh, I guess those things did not protect us from the darkness either. No, right. I literally just think that was just deactivating the shield. Just exit turn base and we all run to safety? Uh, exit turn base, I'm just going to stay where I am. I can't be fucked. I'm like so far from any safety that... Uh, actually, no. Am I? That f no, I am. Yeah, I'm just gonna stay where I am. I'll just take the damage. I've got health potions, and I don't take so as much. Tom and I are already safe. All right. Wait, the middle is. It? Oh, the middle. Yeah, the, the shield way. was deactivated, yeah. but then Tommy activated the trap. Yeah, no, I thought like the middle there would be safe space for you, but it's not. It no. just looks a little bit brighter. This fucking pixie man, shut up. And. <laughs> Come on. There we go. Perfect. Cool. Samuel, this is all you. I'm just going to take a health potion while we... Oh! Never mind. It's not deactivated. How did I get so close? Do we have to pull the levers again or something? I or did it just so glitch that I was able to get that close? I, I guess... I was just delayed. I mean, you know, the, the game is delayed a little bit right now, so maybe that was kind of it. Yeah, did maybe. You, did you get that close in turn base? No. Oh. No, no, it was outside. No, it was literally, was I ran over, right was like, oh, Samo, you can come over here, and then Tommy stepped on the plate, and yeah. yeah. Um, do you guys want to do this side first, then? Sure. Because the door's already open here. And this is a dead end, so this is probably just... God fucking damn it. Next time on Baldur's Gate 3. Stinking pile of ogre after bar.